We are all aware that we can use the ribbon bar to access most of the AutoCAD commands. And so if I wanted to move something, I could drag my mouse up here and choose move. If I wanted to mirror something, I could pick the mirror command here. We all also know that the command prompt is always active. And so I can type in the names of commands. I could type in the word move. I could type in the word mirror to get the move or the mirror command to engage. But if I were to type the letter M, you can see that all of the commands whose names start with the letter M are showing up here in the list. If I type MI, you can see that all the commands that are starting with MI are listed here. So if I wanted to mirror something, I could type MI, wait a couple of seconds for the command to engage, and I see the word mirror up there. I can It's highlighted in blue. I can hit enter, and now it is engaging the mirror command. So this is a benefit of some of the more recent versions of AutoCAD in that if I wanted to RO for rotate, you can see I type in RO, the first two letters of the command, and if I wanted to rotate something, I hit enter and it engages the rotate command. Again, another improvement in AutoCAD, which is very beneficial, especially when we're keyboarding in our commands.